Erin Harrison coming to you from the Santa Clara Convention Center at Cloud Expo. And I'm joined by Steve Leesom, CEO of Mezio. Welcome, Steve. Thank you. Thanks for being here. Um, so tell our audience a little bit about Mezio. And you guys recently made a new announcement about the Mezio Ready program. Tell us okay. about that. Well, Mezio is a deployable cloud storage platform. What Mezio is is middleware. And you can use Mezio to stand up a public or a private software storage software only storage cloud you can use whatever file system or object store and whatever kind of storage hardware you want in order to deliver the storage cloud it's multi-tenant it's secure uh, and today many of the storage clouds in the industry today are based on mezio software the mezio ready program is a program that has a couple of different twists to it. We announced another Mezio Ready partner yesterday, Hexagrid. Mm -hmm. There's a set of Mezio Ready partners that provide technology that works with Mezio to build a storage cloud. So for example, uh, a file system like Nexenta or Gluster, uh, a storage hardware provider, uh, Hexagrid, who's in the cloud computing space. All of these are various technologies that a service provider or an enterprise could select to use to stand up and deliver a complete cloud solution. The second kind of Mezio Ready partners are partners whose solutions run against Mezio storage cloud. So they can hit a Mezio storage cloud and then store a file, uh, uh, get a file, share files, do file collaboration. Okay. So that's the really the two kind of things about Mezio Ready. Okay, thanks. Um, what, talk, talk a little bit about some trends that you're seeing in the cloud storage market. Well, I think that uh, the, the, the most important trend we're seeing is it's starting to mature a little bit. Mm -hmm. uh, we're seeing more adoption. Now, Mezio Cloud Storage is storage that is accessed via REST APIs. Okay. So it's API accessible cloud storage. Uh, there are several products in the market, several cloud storage services in the marketplace that feature REST API access to cloud storage, and we're one of those. Okay. Uh, what's going on, though, is I think people are beginning to realize that, that this kind of cloud storage is important for, say, three reasons. Uh, it came out, everybody liked it because it was cloudy. It was really low cost. Mm -hmm. uh, because of the REST APIs, it can deal with the latency of the Internet. And finally, uh, you could buy what you need on a pay-as-you-go basis, which is kind of the basis right. of cloud. That was the important part of phase one of cloud storage. The important part of phase two is people are now beginning to understand the programmability of API accessible storage. Mm -hmm. So it's not just put a file, get a file, but there are a whole series of API type REST commands that allow you to do what we call advanced functions or advanced services, like publish this file to a URL share this file and send a notification to the, to the individual you shared the file to with a credential to retrieve it. So we call mm -hmm. that secure sharing. Metadata, tagging, there's a bunch of different things going on. And so we're just continuing to see the interest and the activity in the market grow. Okay. Um, talk a little bit about what you see as the key considerations um, when it comes to you know, public versus private cloud storage. Well, what we are seeing is that, uh, first of all, there's certainly a, a big demand for public multi-tenant cloud storage. There's mm -hmm. a lot of different applications and users out there that want to use that. At the same time, there are, uh, particularly in the enterprise, which is still has a security concern, and so regardless of how well we encrypt it and how well we divided it up, right. the enterprise gets worried. And when they get worried, what they want is a private cloud. Uh, why we did Mezio the way we did as deployable software is we knew that it could be deployed inside the firewall by an enterprise for what we would call a single tenant cloud mm -hmm. or it can be used by a service provider to deliver a multi-tenant cloud. So really it's applicable to both the enterprise as well as to the service providers and the telcos. Okay, and when do you think we will finally see enterprise more readily adopt cloud? Well, I, I think they're beginning to, but there's a lot of work to be done. I mean, look at all the companies here that are mm -hmm. all doing this work. So uh, everybody's interested. Everybody's starting to figure it out. Right. Uh, you got to get it into their budget cycle. You got to get them comfortable with it. You got to build the solutions and the business cases, and then they'll adopt. 
Okay. All right. Excellent. Thank you, Steve. I've been speaking with Steve Leeson, CEO of Mezio. I'm Aaron Harrison, coming to you from the Santa Clara Convention Center at Cloud Expo.